Welcome, everybody, to the photo call for the film Chronic, directed by a young Mexican director who's on the left of your screen, Michel Franco. He's come for the photo call with Tim Roth who is starring in the film. He plays a male nurse who is specializing in respite care. And the story tells a story, or the film tells a story of his life at work and also at, in his private life. Michel Franco, first time in the official competition for this Mexican filmmaker screenwriter and also actor. This is his first film in English. Of course, we know him for Despes de Lucia, after Lucia in English, which won the Un Certain Regard Prize in 2012. And he was, uh, his, he first came to Cannes in 2009 with his film Daniel and Anna, which was in the uh, director's fortnight. Along with Tim Roth on your screen, you see the uh, other actors or the actresses in the film, Sarah Sutherland, Robin Bartlett, and Nylia Norvind. That's Sarah Sutherland standing next to Michel Franco. On the left of the screen, it's Nylia Norvind. Sorry, on the right of the screen, standing next to Tim Roth. Nylia Norvind, a Mexican actress. There she is in close-up. And you will also see in the lineup Robin Bartlett, the American actress. That's Robin, who started in film with The Gates to Paradise by Michael Cimino. She was also in Sophie's Choice. Recently, she worked with Scorsese in Shutter Island. And there we have the director and the main lead. Tim Roth has also started to make films himself. That was Sarah Sutherland on the screen a minute ago. The two men from the film on screen now. Mexican director, British filmmaker and actor in this film. Tim Roth, of course, is well known for Reservoir Dogs and Pulp Fiction in Cannes with Quentin, Quentin Tarantino. Pulp Fiction won the Palme d'Or. He was also mentioned at the Oscars for Rob Roy. He played in Mike Lee's Meantime, Woody Allen's Everyone Says I Loves You, Tim Burton's Planet of the Apes, and in Selma by Ava DuVernay. And in 1999, he made his own first feature film called The War Zone. He's acted in TV series, and he will be in Quentin Tarantino's forthcoming film called The Hateful Eight. He's a, a regular here in Cannes. He was president of the, he has been a member of the main competition jury, and he was president of the Un Certain Regard jury in 2012. And in fact, the interesting thing is that he gave the palm, the Un Certain Regard palm, to Michel Franco for Después de Lucia. And so that's perhaps the beginning of their relationship, and perhaps that's what led to their film here today. But perhaps I'm just uh, reading too much into things here. So here we have Tim Roth. Born in 1961, he has made so many films, this man. A lot of supporting roles to begin with. But Robert Altman uh, brought him to, into the limelight to begin with. He's a movie actor, a theatre actor, and also a director now. President of the Un Certain Regard, 2004, uh, rather later than that. 
And that's the year in which he gave the prize to the Mexican director, Michel Franco. It's Tim Roth was president of the Ansat en Regard jury in 2012. Michel Franco is a filmmaker, a di uh, producer also, and a screenplay, a screenwriter. He's got a very unique style. And all of his films have had an impact here in Cannes. Here we have the three actresses in the film. Sarah Sutherland, Nelia Norvin, the Mexican actress, and Robin Bartlett from the States, as is Sarah Sutherland. Robin Bartlett came to Cannes in 2010 with uh, the Coen Brothers film Inside Lewin Davis. And she's also very regularly seen on TV in the States for American Horror Story, The Experts, Nip and Tuck, The Closer. She's made a lot of films. Uh, Naila Norvind has, is mainly a TV star in Mexico. She starred in the film La Otra Familia in 2011. She also works at the theater. She was on the big screen in 2011 in the film La Otra Familia. Sarah Sutherland, oh, you, on your screen it's Nylia Norvin, but earlier on we saw Sarah Sutherland, and she is part of the Sutherland family. So she's a Another link in um, that long line of actors and actresses. She too has acted on television in series such as Veep, The Newsroom. She was recently in Shut Up and Drive, Innocence and Beneath the Half a Sky. Those are three films she's made recently. She learnt the art of the theatre in New York. And here we have uh, Robin Bartlett back on screen. She was in uh, Shutter Island. She was also in Inside Lewin Davis by the um, Cohen brothers. She's often on TV in the States, such as in American Horror Story. She first came to the public's attention in Heaven's Gate. And here we have Sarah Sutherland back on your screen. This is Sarah Sutherland's first time in Cannes. She's representing the Sutherland dynasty today. Sarah studied at the Crossroads Drama Conservatory where she won uh, the Excellence Prize for Dramatic Arts, and then she went on to the experimental theatre wing of the Tisch School of the Arts at New York University. And in this film, she plays the role of Tim Roth's daughter. So here we have the crew grouping together before they come to the studio. We'll be speaking to Michel Franco and Tim Roth here in the studio. In the meantime, let's take a look at uh, some footage from the film Chronic.
want a ride? No, I'm just at the gate there. I'm not far. I'm, Ka I'm Karen, Sarah's niece. I know. Come on, get in. No, I'm just here. Come on. Surprised to see you. Really? Why? Do you always go to your patients' funerals? Sometimes, yes. They told me you got along. She really liked you. So what do you do now, Adi? You, you have another patient? Not yet, no. This is me, just here. Do you want to get some breakfast or something? Just talk a little bit more? I, I, I should go. I just want to ask you a couple of questions about my aunt. 